I'm Michael Dorn, and I'm narrating Master of Orion. In Master of Orion, we pulled out all the stops with a top-tier voiceover cast, comprised of stars from well-known science fiction properties. I'm Mark Hamill, and I play the Alkari Emperor in Master of Orion. We Alkari are to rule over every horizon, even yours. It is the will of the Sky God. The Alkari is a benevolent race, and so they're interested in exploring and expanding. And the, uh, the way it was explained to me, which I like a lot, is exploring is seeing what's around the corner, expanding is seeing what's around the corner and planting your flag on it. And it's nice to be associated with a, a species that is so aspirational. Hi, I'm Kat Cressida, and I am playing the Mershon Empress. I look at your mewling fleet and wonder, who put the cat among the pigeons? What truly struck me the first time I got to see the, the new rebooted version is how fully evolved the ships are, the universe, the strategy. It is so fully immersive, and you really feel like you are in this completely new universe. Diplomatic relations between the Bulrothi Empire and the al Kari flock have worsened. My name is Dwight Schultz, and I voice the lead anchor on GNN. I remember playing it. It was one of the first video games I played on my PC. It's much better than I remember. It's so much better. Greetings, controller. Our labs are staffed and ready to start researching. I'm the Cylon advisor. Cylon? But not the vr vr kind. The kind of <laughs> kind. Oh, yes, the military probing agency would like us to invest in this. His um, metabolism's running a little hot. He can eat whatever he wants, which, you know, there's an inner happiness there. You obtuse piece of flotsam. It was folly to trust you in the first place. I'm John Delancey. I play the human emperor in Master of Orion. The elements of the original game you, you, you recognize as being 20 years ago. The essence of it has been reproduced. The blood, the, the, you know, the, the organs of it are, are still there, and, and the spirit of it is still there. And so it came to pass that the Alkari flock took roost on Orion. I'm John Kassir. I'm playing the Alkari advisor. Welcome, your highness. What wisdom do you seek? This video game's not only classic, it's legendary. When I look at what the game used to look like and what it looks like now, it's even more fun to play and then it has a lot added to it. Plus, it's visually incredibly pleasing to watch. We have an amazing brand new race that we're introducing for the first time, the Terran Khani. I'm Robert England, and I am playing the Khan in Master of Orion. Long have my people suffered in the past, but be warned, we will abide no more. I see the Khan as these sort of galactic refugees. Now, they're, they're humans, but uh, they've been through the grinder. They've been forged by war. Think of them as, as Vikings in space. It is for the good of the common people that you must be deposed. We come not as conquerors, but liberators. We are taking this game to the height of our technology of the modern age, and that is AAA graphics, that is immersive gameplay, that means a polished presentation that is designed for a new generation of gamers. Master of Orion, conquer the stars! Why will the flock conquer the stars? Look to the skies for adventure. Rise from the ashes. Take to the skies in Master of Orion.